my god. <laughs> God help me. Hello and welcome back to my channel. I haven't posted in, I would say, a couple weeks. Let me just um, get that out of the way. I have no other excuse other than me dying on the weekends and being sick. Pure laziness and um, yeah, I can't think of another excuse. But anyways, um, I thought in today's video I would do kind of like a get ready with me turning myself from a zero to at least a seven. And if you think your volume or your speakers are a little bit weird, you are wrong. Um, your sound is completely fine. I recently got an Isalign. You wanna see it? And that is the reason why I have a lisp. So it was a lot worse two weeks ago. Someone is in my laundry room. Fun fact, the lights to my laundry room are connected to the lights in my closet. So every single time someone goes into my laundry room, they also turn on the lights to my closet. But I'm here with Mrs. Biggs. Hi. Say hi. Oh my God, you're so cute. I just want to you. <laughs> So we're going to start making myself a little bit more presentable on this wonderful Sunday afternoon. So I just took a shower and my hair is uh, predominantly dry. It's a little bit frizzy, a lot of bit frizzy if you can tell. This is why I take showers at night. So in the morning, it's not like this, but um, I took a shower this morning because I felt disgusting so i'm just gonna do my makeup get ready and try to turn myself into a seven i'm also wearing a really cute pink sweater yeah i think we're just gonna fix this oh, oh i have a hair in my mouth this is gonna be harder than i thought <coughs> i'm also kind of sick um getting over a uh, sickness as i do every weekend so i'm gonna take these bad boys off i'm using the tarte shape tape concealer I really hope while I'm editing this that I'm not gonna be annoyed at the fact that I have a freaking lisp and I didn't take out my aligners before I filmed, but you know, whatever. This is in light neutral. I used to use a sponge, like a blending sponge, a beauty blender, but then uh, Miss Biggs chewed it. So I stopped buying it and uh, I've just been using, you know, brushes this entire time. <coughs> And I've just kind of been too lazy to get a beauty blender, but I, I, I'm wondering now if I should rebuy one. I almost did one time and then I literally put it back. I like went to Target, picked up a beauty blender, like one of those eco tool ones or whatever, walked to the other side of Target, then came all the way back because I was unsure of the fact that I was buying a beauty blender. Next, I am using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Finishing Powder. It's nice, um, it's just a translucent powder, although I have realized, oh, I need to shake it up. I have realized that in pictures, if you put on a lot, you get a lot of flashback, and it's not necessarily the cutest thing, if you know what I mean, ladies or men. That's something to think about when you're buying this, but uh, for the most part, it does its job, and it's vegan, so uh, two thumbs up. I also don't really like the way it smells. It kind of smells weird. It's it's not good. A lot of times I hold in my breath when I put it on because, oh, sorry, Mrs. Biggs. See, Mrs. Biggs doesn't even like it. I've been using the ColourPop Dream Street. I've been using usually these two colors together separately by itself on my crease. Then I take my finger, usually my ring finger, for my right hand. And I get this color, and then this one right here, and I just kind of dab it on my lid. Then I take my Innuendo, also by ColourPop, and I usually use a combination of these four highlighters. Lately, I've been using these two or these two together. Then I take a smaller, very tiny brush, if I, it. Dab it a little bit and I put it on my brow bone. I'm going a little bit backwards here. I take my NYX baked blush in chiffon brush 
And then lastly, but not least, I take my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Love the bottle, it's very cool. It's like a pistol kind of, like a pink pistol. Pistol? No. Bullet, a pink bullet. I don't know, I just, I like it. That is what I do for my everyday makeup pretty much, you know, when I want to go from a negative 45 to a 7 or a 6 if it's a good day. And for this hair, you know, nothing's really going to save this hair um, unless I shave it off. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching this video. I had a lot of fun filming it. It was fun. It was fresh. You know, this look is perfect if you want to hit up the club, if you want to hit up the library. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. If you haven't, subscribed down below. And yeah, I post videos every single Monday. At least I try to. So click on the bell notifications if you want to be notified every single time I upload a video. Like I said, it would be every Monday and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye